morning. Welcome to our channel, VMB TV. I'm Bob, the Red Nose Veteran. And I am Heather, possibly the Pink Nose Blonde. We are doing another video for you guys. If you hadn't noticed, we were missing Blame the Veteran. He decided to catch, like, I don't even know, a lung infection. He has been down for the count, so we are very excited to be back on camera. He is alive and well. Alive and well. Tell me, alive and well. Tell me your experience. How many times did you see a doctor? Thank you, Heather. <laughs> he loves his Christmas gift. Heather, you rock. Thank you so much. And it's very sweet. We're going to buy some more MREs so we can enjoy them for you guys. I was just excited. And then Bob's going to show what we are airing today. We are so excited. And yay. So, the last time we did an order from BornMRE.com. They are so cool, super fast shipping. They have tons of stuff you can try. My dog is joining the picture again. He loves these videos. And we ended up getting an actual British MRE. Last time it was like a grab bag box, so we didn't actually see what they get. Look at this huge box. This is menu 10. Like a big, look at all like the warnings all over it. Talks about what it is, nutritional data is on this side. And it's heavy. It's probably like three or four pounds worth of food. I can imagine you carrying this nonsense. But it's so cool. Look at the awesome flag. Sick. We're going to show you guys some. We're definitely not trying all of this food right now. It's a lot of food. We're going to break it into parts. We're only showing you guys a few pieces. And you're going to have to stay tuned and watch us as we do the reveal. And we try them. We could win prizes if we enter this. I don't know if we count because we're civilians. But it's really cool. They give you this little piece of paper. And if you're serving, you can give them your feedback. And it literally, there's the fill-in spot. Here's like where the cool feedback is. Look at his little faces. You can say if it was yummy, happy, how'd you like it? And they try to make them better. That is so cool. I really like that. Even though I don't know if we can do it. We're not going to show everything, but we will show some of it. And then one of them, Bobby, is going to try for you guys today because we're going to do breakfast this morning. He's going to try some British breakfast tea. Mm, he loves tea. Can I do the tea now? Yes, he's going to prep his tea. And then we'll show a few more while he does that one. I'll show you my drink, what I'm going to make. So what I am going to try this morning is some hot cocoa, and it says mint flavor. That sounds really good. So we have our boiling water. I actually added some milk to mine. Hot chocolate and milk sound better. So we're going to try that. And then the next thing we're going to try, which we have been in love with muesli. I didn't realize so many countries had muesli. I mean, I guess for us it's I never heard the word before. I had never either until I watched Crazy Russian Hacker, which is awesome. And he made muesli look so good because I love oatmeal. But we are trying this one. Mmm. I think it's apple, apple and cinnamon. So yay. We also heated up, well, we preheated some hot milk. We're also going to cook it on fire while we try some other stuff, but look how big that is. Like, it's massive. Trying that. We have some napkins. We've now determined these were definitely British. And then the other thing we are going to try this morning is this one. It is called a date fruit strawberry bar. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It feels really dense, so I have a feeling it's, it's like hard. It's really cold here, too, so it could froze. And then we're not trying this right now, but we will show you guys because we have tried something like it. We got one of these cool fruit explosions. The last one we had was yellow. This one's kind of orange. I don't know if you can see how orange it really is, but it is orange. And on the back it says, if it's orange, it is apple and peach. Mmm. So that one might be really good. And then we got a whole bunch of other goodies inside the bag. We're going to probably try these matches that are in here, maybe to light our fire. And then and spoon. Oh yeah, we'll show you guys how cool a spoon is. This is like a spoon you save. It's like heavy duty. It's huge. And then look at it's a spoon but it has teeth. Look at the little no no. It's a spork. It's a spork. But yeah, it's like heavy duty and massive. Like it's a big spoon. We'll save this one. We'll eat it with one of the lunch or dinner meals. And we'll show you guys what the main meal is in here. We're gonna leave the rest as a surprise. Stay tuned and watch us try them and open them. This is the main meal it came with. Looks like for dinner. 
and it is a Moroccan style bean stew. It's pretty thick and heavy duty. So I'm sure there's going to be some goodies in here. Mmm. So yeah, this one we're going to try in another video when we do more of the dinner type products. So we will move this over for now. Remember, we're doing British. And then the other the cool thing that we got while we have been in our downtime was this wicked stove. This thing is huge. The picture on Amazon did not do it justice. I mean, it made it look like it was just little. It's huge and like you can fold it up and it has like a perfect, it makes like a little box. It can hold all your rest of your dry fuel tabs in there. That's how it came. The dry fuel tabs are giant as well. Look how big they are. They're huge. So these are going to be so cool. We're going to set this fire in my kitchen. See what happens. You can change, I'll put it because I'm kind of in a dark outfit, but you can widen it however big like your pot is or whatever you're cooking. So that's really cool. We're using our nifty pot set that Bobby got us. That is really neat. Bam. So it fits perfectly on here. What are, uh, you, wait, what are you cooking? We are going to kind of heat the oatmeal in here. Even though I have a hot water milk, we're going to use the fire because... We know you guys love watching us on fire. We do so well. Bobby is going to try to be our lighter man. He's going to do it. Ooh. That's a really slick bag. Now you want to hold it? You want to risk yeah. that? He's Let's crazy. Try not to light my fingers on fire. He's trusting the blonde. Hey, we can maybe make this into another cartoon. Those are matches. You guys haven't seen our cartoons? This Coming up on my ideas. Like the edge. So here's a striker. Comes with a striker. And it comes with my favorite color pink. Pink lighter. And that's huge. Look at how much it's going to burn. It's going to get me in the process. It'll burn Bobby. We'll see. Me. This thing's so bendable. Ah. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. It looks like a firework. Huh. Oh, shoot. Oh, these are not cool. Just not cool. <laughs> Did go so fast. Where's what your, is that? Where's your lighter? Yeah, we're using a lighter. Seriously, I will say, you people that can use these, go you. Here. Okay, we're going to try the lighter. Can't go wrong with the lighter, I guess. Trying to burn off Bobby's hand. Ooh. Oh, 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 yes. Ooh. How about that? Perfect. How about that? Dang, that's gonna be big. That's kind of scary. That's gonna be crazy. How about that? And it's really cool. This thing says it has like all the openings, so it can like let air get to the flame. Oh, that was neat. All right, so we're going to dump in. There is some weird looking. Oh, there's some weird looking things in here. I think there's sunflower seeds. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what that is. I'll show you guys. Maybe that fire's kind of getting huge. All right, so this thing came with a whole bunch of nonsense. Like, look at all the powders. There's like nuts. I don't even know. Dropping it. All right, so let's add some of our milk in, and then we're going to put this on that fire and hope everything goes well. <laughs> it's going to be the answer. All right, I'm going to stick that in there and see. Oh heavens! That just does not look good. Mm. Does that look good to you? Well, as of right now, it's just oats with stuff floating. Some of this is gonna melt, I think, and become a flavor. I'm not sure. We'll see. This it's gonna be a surprise. It does not look. Good. All right. Why well, don't you open our bar? He's gonna open our bar. I'm gonna make my drink. So now, this says drink. it's produced in Spain. Wow. This is Spanish. Spanish? Ooh. Just like normal looking cocoa powder. We're going to mix it. Mm. I'll mix it. Well, it does not look good. <laughs> Looks like a big fruit bar. No, we'll break this off a piece. I don't, I don't want to touch it. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Let's give this a stir. I think the last time I made mousseli like this, I kind of let it burn. So, 
We're going to try not to let it burn. All right. So it's, oh, no, it breaks a lot easier than it felt in the wrapper. But yeah, it's just like a fruit bar. Hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Hmm. It's okay. Not a fruit bar. Ooh. Ooh. Whoa. Now that is huge. How many of you think we're going to be able to blow that out? That one might be scary. It's very muted. It's a muted fruit. It's really good. Oh, I'm scared to do this. You don't want to light the blonde on fire. I think the nah. mucily is perking here. Good lord. I don't know if we should have used a whole... Uh, that is good. A whole thing. Yeah, that's looking really... We might have should have just used a... Someone might want to dial the fire department. Let's see how long they get here. <laughs> Alright. We're going to let this kind of... Did you try that? No. Oh my gosh, try it. Good. It is so good. This tastes like an Andy's mint. Like an Andy, for us, an Andy's mint. I'm like, mmm, that's so good. It's minty chocolate. That tastes like an Andy's mint. Mm. Doesn't that actually taste good? Mmm. I bet. That's so good. Tastes like an Andy's mint melted. Not only is it that bad. It's like a fruit bar. Nothing from Tabulous. I was not mm. a fan. No, yeah, okay. Mm, let's see. We don't give Bobby much. I know he isn't going to eat no, much. No, let's... Let's at least give you an apple. Because I think this is an apple. You're absolutely certain that's what that is. Positive. Has to be. There's nothing else left. All right, so we'll give him some without a seed in case he doesn't want to risk eating a seed. I don't know what those are, honestly. I'll show you guys one by itself so you can what see. What are those black things? I don't know. That's left to be undetermined. What? What? What is that? Come on, Brits, help us out. Anyone else who has eaten this? What is that? It smells very bland. Like, it smells like it has no flavor. <laughs> it's really hot. Look at the steam. Oh my gosh. That's a good cooker. It's like hot in zero to five seconds. <laughs> mm-hmm. He's not gonna like it. It needs like I don't know. Sugar, butter, flavor. Eat the apple bite and see the apple bite. I could eat that curtain and there's more flavor <laughs> than this. This is, yeah, kind of funky. Oh, that's really good. Maybe you're supposed to like, I don't know, it needs something. Yeah, turkey loaf. <laughs> There's some of these little apples. See, I think those are apples. Whoops. They splooged. <laughs> <laughs> mm. That's awful. Not very good. Even the apple chunk isn't like, mmm. I don't taste cinnamon at all. I thought the Russian raspberry one smelled to die for. It had a good linger, but it was very pasty too. Did you eat one of those black things? Mmm. And I determined what they were. What they are, are pumpkin seeds. Seeds? Mmm. -hmm. Oh boy. It's a pumpkin seed. Pumpkin seeds. <laughs> Not just cinnamon at all. It was so weird. You like that? No. No. What no. about what about this thing? Not bad, but it was very bland too. Both are very muted. Oh. This taste taste this now. Eat a little bite of it now. It tastes so much better after eating the oatmeal. 
Take a little well, bite. Yeah, chewing on a napkin would taste better. Mm. Now the flavor kind of like bursts. This has flavor. Yeah. Bursts, all right. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Mm. This isn't as bad. But you have to eat the oatmeal. This, though, is to die for. This hot chocolate mint. Just like an Andy's candy. I love it. How's your tea? Tea's not bad. Tea's not bad. But the, this is the first time you've had breakfast British tea? No, we've had that before, haven't we? No, no, not that kind. You've never had a breakfast tea yet. Tastes... I'm all sticky again. Yeah, these dry naps will help with that. Mm -mm. <laughs> I think this is delicious. I would drink the drink again. That's yeah. still no good. I don't know. Still no good. Yeah. They need... I don't know. There's no cinnamon. I don't taste cinnamon at all. Like, I don't even like cinnamon, and I don't taste cinnamon at all. It's so weird. I think someone mislabeled this. It was apple for sure, but... Mm. That's awful. Mm. This is really good. So, cross your fingers that more in this box he might like. Watch what we found, Bobby. If you haven't seen our cartoons, look at this hat. Show it. Oh, can you see our logo? We got the V&B TV. Oh, it's slick and shiny. It's his protecto cap, you know, because you never know what could happen inside this kitchen. Look at that. Some slickness right there. Mm -hmm. But stay tuned. Like, comment below if you enjoyed eating this before. I don't know. It was not our favorite. Let us know if there's any countries you want us to try. We're looking for a few others right now, and we have some coming in the mail. So stay tuned and subscribe to see more of our cheery faces and send good wishes to the Bob. We need him well so we can do these videos for you guys. But stay tuned. Take care.